Let's go. Morning everyone, I hope you're all doing great guys. I just boarded now my ferry. We are on our way to Dar es Salaam from Zanzibar. I have a very very mad headache. I've been crying the whole night. This morning as well, the same thing guys. I have attachment issues. I don't know. I'm just too emotional guys. The past few days was very very great. Spending the time on auntie's birthday with everybody. So I woke up this morning, I was really not in my feeling. I was supposed to get the ferry at 4 p.m. but I heard that I was fully booked. I'm still I'm still very sad. But what can I do? Just happy seeing everybody, you know, we had fun, you know. This experience will live with us for a very long time. You know, the weather is so nice today. That's why I wanted to take this ferry in the first place because the experience is mad and the weather is amazing today. So I can go outside and just, you know, get some future for you guys. <sighs> I'm so hungry. I did not eat anything. Even yesterday, I told you guys, said, I said yesterday they were going to do a barbecue party, but it was all lies. They didn't do anything. So, I didn't eat much yesterday and this morning as well, I did not have breakfast, so hopefully I will get something on the boat. This boat is very cool. I'm just waiting for everybody to be seated and once we move, I will just, you know, go outside and show you, I'll show you around. And you know me, I love water, so that's a plus for me. Anything water, count me in anytime. So, all right, I'm about to ask for tea because I need to eat something. Hi guys, I'm in Dar es Salaam right now. I just got to my hotel no long ago and I'm staying at Element. Guys, this place is nice, it's amazing. I love it already. And guess what, it's actually an apartment. Behind me, there's a kitchen and microwave, guys. Guess what I'll be doing to all those takeaways. No more throwing my takeaways, no. I'll be cooking, I'll be warming my food. <laughs> And everything. So I think the kitchen got me more excited because you know, you know what we do to those takeaways when you're in a hotel. There's no microwave. There is no nothing, so you can't do anything. So I think I'm so happy with the kitchen. I'm just gonna quickly give you guys a tour of this room before because I wanna go out. I wanna do my nails. I wanna go fix my nails. My toes are so fucked. I don't know all those activities we're doing in the water and the pool, so my my toes are just so bad. So I just called my friend. She's currently not in Dar es Salaam. She's in, in Kenya right now. So I just called her and she told me where I can go fix my nails, which is really closer to where I'm staying. So I'm just gonna quickly go there. But before that, let me give you guys a tour of this place. It's so nice and I have a poolside view. Guys, you know me by now, me and water best friend so yeah let's go so when you're coming in this is the door i just want to open okay let me just <laughs> let me do it properly okay so this is the entrance and right here you have this cupboard safe and a cute mirror yeah that's my bag over there 
and these guys the shower is amazing very spacious so sad that i'm not <laughs> and a mirror again um i love mirrors guys quite clean and this here is everything guys and there is me and here is me and there is me guys i've added so much weight after all of them like, i don't know what's going on but this needs to go okay let's go on here we have a little office which i'm not gonna use i'm 100 percent sure and we have this here so nice um yeah the kitchen is here as well all the cabinets we have plates over here i have to wash them again and we have pots pans i got this for my friend from nigeria i didn't know they don't have it in, in tanzania this is our cute little microwave and guys guess what i've already store everything that my cousin brought for me from burundi these are sausages guys i know it's sausages but these are burundian sausages okay all right and the rumbo rumbo is like salami yeah okay we don't have this also in lagos you can only get the best in burundi and this is lobe <laughs> my cousin is gonna kill me this is i don't know what to call it in english but this is we call it raw wear in my country so it's very delicious it's also made from cassava so yeah guys and here we also have guys i love this i love this here we have another mirror as well there's me again we've also got some art so beautiful i don't know why this is here but okay so this is my bed very spacious very big and right here we have my favorite spot already guys i just entered this place and quickly went to sit over there because i was so tired i had to lift my legs for a few minutes and made some calls this standing lap is also very beautiful and that's the tv over there and this is my favorite part look how big the window is and very long from the floor up to the ceiling can you see that and tada there you have my favorite spot a pool okay guys this place is so beautiful i love you already i'm so excited all right guys this is the end of my room tour i'm just quickly going to book me an uber and to the salon i guess i text you guys should i go with you guys i think you like to Mm, let me think let me think should i go with you guys or no i think i have to go with you guys so stay tuned let's go you can see i'm so fucking excited i don't know it's been so long me being on a solo trip like yeah this is like a solo trip to dar es salaam by myself um i just didn't want to go back to lagos without coming here yeah because this place is so beautiful and um yeah why not so and it's been so long i've been like in lagos for like a whole year i didn't go out of lagos so yeah i'm actually very very happy me being here <laughs> so let's go let's go do my nails hi guys i am back again i'm back in my room um i didn't like my nails to be honest i did if you know me you know i'm very very particular with how i like my nails done 
I did not like it at all but at least the guy tried I was not pissed because the guy really tried and maybe what I was asking was beyond his skills and everything so um, and there's a way someone listen and follow the instructions when you are telling them what you want to do so that's why I was like you know what I'm just gonna let it slide for today I was not mad so I just wanted my nails to be a little bit decent because my nails were so fucked like I didn't have like the gel literally came off on four of my nails so it was really really bad and I don't like looking like that so um so now I'm just going to get into the shower and you know relax a bit get something to eat I want to go out today is Friday I'm not sleeping tonight um so yeah just quickly i don't know if i'm gonna end this vlog here but if i do hope you guys had a very wonderful day and yeah i uh, guess i will talk oh my god guys i need to remove this thing i've been wearing this we got this from the hotel and i've been wearing it since we go to zanzibar and i forgot to uh, uh, to ask them to remove it at the reception when i was checking out so yeah guys if um i end this vlog here and i wish you all a pleasant night because me i am going out i'm not going to sleep i can't sleep i can't even sleep so yeah and if i decide to continue vlogging well stay tuned you know <laughs> all right guys downstairs i'm having breakfast guys i went out last night it was mad yesterday i went to a wavivu temple i was just alone because you know like i said my friend is not in town and my other one she was so tired and she was far so she just you know just called her friend and asked if her friend could take me out later on in the night so i started by um, so that's why i first went to wabibu camp guys that place is mad like the vibe all the hype i was seeing on instagram is all worth it like it's absolutely such an experience that you must have if you are visiting dar es salaam after Wawibu came through, that's when I went to meet my friend's friend in a place called, it's a lounge and it's a Nigeria lounge as well called uh, 1245 guys, we stayed there till morning when I was at Rio, when I was in Zanzibar, I only had breakfast once because that place, no, 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 that place is so big very, very big to go from point A to point B you have to ask for a golf car I mean it's not like I'm lazy I just don't like to stress myself secondly um, I'm just not a morning person guys I don't eat in the morning I don't like it I, from on holiday if I don't have anything serious that's waking me up I'd rather just stay in and sleep till I'm, I'm ready to wake up but today is a good day I'm in a good mood I don't know what I'm going to do later but I will definitely want to meet up with my friend for late lunch then in the night i don't know hi there i am back again guys that nap i took a magical nap guys i slept like a baby i feel so so relaxed right now guys i'm about to go to um jackie's i want to eat something called mchemsho it's my favorite so mchemsho is a mixture of um green banana and irish potato and chicken soup a little bit spicy so um, that's my favorite guys i love it and i'm about to go and eat it right now as my lunch because i did not have lunch today but i'm still waiting for my friend latifa um she's on her way here we are going to go together we wanted to actually go to avuvi camp guys i went to avuvi camp i keep saying about avuvi camp i went there yesterday and i absolutely love it so i wanted to catch the sunset today but it's a bit late and she's a bit far i guess uh, i'm going to go downstairs just chill by the poolside until she gets here 
there we go and i'm also going to take you guys along with me please forget the mess at the back i did not ask them to make my bed today because not the every day with they change our bed sheet you get <laughs> by the way guys i'm wearing this lovely uh boo boo dress i got it from lagos i bought it a day before i traveled i absolutely love it guys i think i'm getting too comfortable with this ready to wear thingy in lagos and i absolutely love it so comfortable and you know quite affordable especially this one i love the material i love the texture and the colors let me show you guys this room is a mess i didn't even know i was a messy girl like this anyway i'm not it's just today okay let me close this before you uh, see what you're supposed to see okay all right so guys look at my stuff scattered everywhere so this is how it looks like i love this can make it more shorter but this is what i like hey guys what do you think and the headpiece but i don't know how to properly tie this i really tried and i feel like this is how it's supposed to look so guys i'm going to go downstairs and wait for my friend to get here and go have some and you guys are going to come with me so let's go hi guys so i'm already at jackie's and one thing i forgot to mention about this place it's a very local place but guess what guys the food food is so delicious i'm gonna show you around and you're gonna see the cars that are parked here and it's just it's just five so i've already ordered my chim show but i think i'm gonna order brochette as well brochette uh, beef skewers so yeah i'm gonna show you what my orders look like i'm gonna show you guys what i ordered guys the cars go all the way down there and up there it's crazy and the other cars are at the other side of the road and this is how it looks like flies everywhere but it's okay guys this is our first orders we got mishkaki brochette plantain yeah. <laughs> yes brochette still so me i'm just gonna wait for my chim show
good morning everyone i hope you all slept very well guys um this is my last day in dar es salaam and i'm going to the market kariako market right now guys i cannot come to dar es salaam and go home without buying new diras and spices you know tea spices rice spices you know yesterday i went to jackie's and we ended up going to a movie again and after our movie again i went out so yes that's why i didn't vlog again and also guys i'm going with this bonnet like this i can't be bothered because my my braids are so long and so uncomfortable and it's going to be very hot so this one is going to be very helpful so all right guys let's go to Kariako market and get divas oh yeah i forgot to mention that i'm gonna get divas for my friend as well because they always like my divas they're like oh these are nice where'd you hear them from so yeah i'm just gonna get a few for them and yes that's it Guys, I'm so tired. I'm sitting in the market. I was meant to just get the divas and spices, and I ended up buying a lot of things. Now I'm buying um, rice beans. After here, I'll just go back to the heaven My bag, and I want to go out tonight as well. So, yeah. This is what I got, and this is what I got for her. So beautiful. Guys, I went to visit my friend, and she made this for me. I just told them that I wanted to eat coconut rice, coconut fish, and coconut beans. Guys, I'm in heaven. Like, this is what i was craving for so long hi guys i'm back again I, I went to see my friend and she made food for me guys i was so craving a rice it's um coconut fish coconut beans so bad but i then saw avocado guys i'm allergic to avocado and by the way the avocado was looking at me it was so tempting i couldn't resist it Guess what guys, I ate avocado and I fell sick. I just, I didn't even finish eating. I just started throwing up. I was so, I don't know. But now today is over me and avocado. I will never eat avocado anymore. So now we are going to Cape Town. I'm going with her and her other friends. We are going to Cape Town. They are there already. But because I came home just, you know, to get ready and relax for a bit. That's why I'm a bit late. So yeah. I'm on my way to Cape Town. I cannot spoil. No allergy can spoil my last night in Dar es Salaam. I'm going to turn up and <laughs> get ready for the airport later. <laughs> Oh, you 
Guys, um, we just got in Kenya and I slept through the whole flight. Um, luckily for me, when we got here, there's napping um, space which was free, so I just quickly put my bag there and um, came to take my uh, food. So, guys, I just want to eat now and go and sleep i'm trying to sleep till five at least i am so tired you guys can see my eyes so let me quickly eat and go take a nap so i'll talk to you guys later hi guys um just woke up i took a very magical nap guys i feel so refreshed i feel so good i was so tired tired is an understatement i was not even walking straight that's how tired i was the waiter was really so kind he saw how tired i was i was struggling to even pick up a plate so he just dished my food and he was like make sure you eat fruit i'm gonna get you some fruit you need to eat so you can relax your flight is late it's like 6 p.m just go and relax i'm gonna get you blanket this it was so helpful guys i feel bad i don't even have small cash so i can give it to him but yeah anywho um i can't wait to get home guys i feel like i've been on this journey for the past one week you know i left zanzibar with the ferry and to dar es salaam and now it's like oh god it's too much i just can't wait to get home all right guys um i will talk to you guys later when um, I get home.